Hi guys, welcome to my videos. So guys, uh, today in this video, we're going to walk through how to cancel your UK visa application. So before I proceed further, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe right now. And I would also like to clarify neither I am an immigration consultant nor I'm a government body. So if you take anything out of this video, you do it at your own risk. All right, guys, so let's proceed. So guys, a uh, lot of people ask this question. Sometimes they change their mind. Sometimes because of the delay, they want to withdraw their application basically they want to cancel and uh, you can apply to cancel at any stage but uh, that doesn't mean you're going to get a refund right and there's that doesn't mean that it's going to be cancelled right so that's why you got to be very careful with uh, these kinds of things so let's see how you can do so in front of you i've opened this official uk uh, immigration site there where they have clearly written that suppose your application is denied that doesn't mean you're going to be here getting a refund because the fee any uh, fee that they are charge you is for the processing not to give you a positive decision that's something else and if you have a visa granted and you don't use it that doesn't mean that you are entitled for refund no now how to cancel your it depends upon what kind of visa you have applied and how you were proved to uh prove your identity when you started your uh, online application so in most of the cases you get like app, uh, uh, attend an uh, appointment to provide your biometrics okay or uh, in some cases you get immigration id check smartphone app to upload and uh, scan your identity document so if you have been told to attend appointment and you have not given your fingerprint and photo so basically if you are at this stage where you have been told to attend and you haven't so that means a decision hasn't reached on your application so you can cancel your application online okay it's stage six because i have not gone to that stage in any of the applications so i cannot show you but it's clearly there that you can apply over there like uh, if you have applied within the uk you can click on this form to withdraw if you have applied outside uk you can sign into the account and go to section six further uh, actions to cancel your application so when i open this you have these forms if you click on next application category which one you have applied for and this is for inside uk okay you want to withdraw the application you're going to click yes if you go to next then you are going to provide the details and from here you can withdraw but if you are from outside uk then uh, online you can too now and now the situation if you were told to attend the appointment and you have already given then if you are from uk you can use the same link if you have outside uk then you can contact uk visa and immigration to to cancel so let's see how it goes what you need help with is there anything like uh that does something else i see next what languages pose english So you can contact them online and if there's a fee or you can contact them by phone as well top of your standard network charge oh wow but they are like holiday hours so close but anyway fine so let's see if i want to contact them online First, I need to confirm details, payment account, payment details, confirmation. Sorry, guys. I know you want really want to walk uh, walk through all this, but unfortunately, I don't want to pay for this, right? So I cannot show you that. That's fine. If you use a smartphone app, you can cancel application online. You will be refunded if these things matter. After you ca cancel your application, it may get up to 28 days. Wow. 
if you are going to get a refund and as they said you're not going to get refund in every case so that's how it works guys and i hope you're going to like this video thanks for watching this guys please subscribe to the channel thank you